Hey guys, uh, this video is about health system, uh, my free plugin on marketplace. Uh, this one will be best you will get for free or even a paid plugin uh, because I will give you examples to use this for standalone listen server or as client for dedicated servers. I will explain explain everything. Okay. Uh, my English is not so good, so please try to understand. Uh, you can get this plugin in two ways. Uh, first, you can get this for free on Marketplace. Uh, this is available for UE 5.4, 5.3, 5 5.2, or you can get this from uh, GitHub. You can just download the zip or use it. Uh, so let's start what you will get from here so from here you can add health or add maximum health so first how you can use it so like i have a character i can add a component uh, this one is named triple health system okay uh, so what you will get from this uh, there is three variables uh, first one is health this one will be current health you can say for a player uh, here is max health uh, this one is a very important variable uh, because uh, we will compare this one as a initial value uh, of health this maximum health okay and here is health percentage bar uh, this will define like in percentage uh, like you have health of 100% मतलब and uh, I mean 100 health and 100 percentage means 100 upon 100 uh, you will get get a value of one for your progress bar. Uh, this plugin uh, also have four events. First one is on current health changed like when uh, current health changes this event trigger auto. Okay and another one is max health here is health bar and max health bar okay uh, so there is some events uh, or you can say functions let me explain you can add health uh, in this function you can tick to override uh, this value like you your health is 80 and you add a like 55 value if you want your health to just uh, maximum like 100 or 120 you can leave this as well if you want to override this value like uh, max health or current health can cross this value you can tick this okay and second one is add max you can override uh, this max health value as well and here is some more important functions you can get all of them you can reduce your health uh, you can reduce your max health you can set your current health set your max health this dg value uh, like you set like you first uh, when you edit uh, you are you are a plugin editor you can test like your health is 100 when you set this one as like 120 your current health will be 120 uh, means this value will be overrided same for maximum health okay so next thing is you can generate health uh, i will explain it soon so how i'm using this first let's see uh, let's play in standalone and see how this works so i'm here in standalone i have two progress bars uh, in the bottom is ui in the top it's player health you can use this one uh, based on your requirements uh, you can see it's increasing 
uh, based on time i have just a function and this will regenerate or you can uh, stop the logic for regeneration based on your requirement so let's try this one on lesson server playing as two players uh, here this one is my server and my server hits i player can see only a head progress bar not on ui progress bar okay what if client goes in if client goes in client has change uh, what if this one goes to zero uh, you will get something like uh, this will uh, this person is dead and you can write your own logic like uh, to uh, end the game or whatever you want to do if this one is dead and here is last one for dedicated servers uh, play as client so these both are clients for here or uh, if client uh, one enters you can see uh, the chance what if client 2 enters if client 2 enters you can see uh, this one replicated and you can see as well uh, increasing their progress bar or health okay so let me explain how i implemented this in just these lines okay first thing you have to add this triple health system component in your uh, class like you are this can be your vehicle your animal your ai anything okay and on poges on poges i'm using a event uh, that one is replicated only for client and this one is reliable for this i'm using a controller this one is my custom controller you can make your own like it's my triple pc and here i'm just creating a event just created for this i'm using a widget uh, very simple just create this uh, for self and add it to viewport uh, in this I'm using this uh, health UI uh, this one contains only one thing health progress bar I'm setting this percentage value one by default or you can set this one one on construct or anywhere you want and you can override this one as well it's color okay so both these parts done so here one uh, poses events called or you can call this one on begin play or uh, actor you are actor uh, begin play or poses uh, as you wish on your owning client you cast to that player controller and that player controller will uh, call that event okay so we have another thing that is damage for this damage i have just a collision box a text that is showing damage and a plane so we can check uh, so this one is just a visual representation main thing is done by this box okay so when we overlap with the box we are checking uh, or we are getting the component that is health subsystem uh, health system we are checking if this one is valid or not if this one is valid we are causing damage to that actor who has this component uh, investigator uh, controller for this event is for damage like for self you can use this one of your choice this events call on server okay uh, this part is done and we just drag and drop this uh, into here 
okay so what happens if we enter this box so let me show you once i enter uh, this events uh, this event triggers and this one check if i have this component if i have valid component this will damage me okay so here in that actor when i get damaged uh, for from this triple health system i will call reduce health every time i get damage this will reduce some health this damage okay i will check if i am dead or not uh, if i am dead i can or you can call your own logic like to end the game or do anything what you want to play any animation of dead uh, remove controls inputs like what you want if it's not done you can uh, you are free to use this one if you want to if you don't want to use uh, generate the health just don't use it okay but let me show you if you want to generate the health you can just connect this one you can give time like in how many times like in every two seconds you want to generate uh, you want to call this event again and, and again until this one reaches the max health i mean this one if you have 150 this will call again again and again until uh, your health will be 150 okay so you can add a value to add in this time like in every two seconds my, i will add five health okay uh, once health reaches the maximum health this will stop okay so no need to worry about this uh, this will trigger us when my health changes you can do your own logic uh, here is my uh, updated health bar this event is for health bar i'm using two things first one is for ui on owning client uh, i have to check if the controller is mine or uh, another client or server if you are playing on listen server so i have to check if this one is valid or not if this one is valid i will get health ui uh, that i has in my controller here that i make this one a variable from this variable i will get my health bar and i will set this that percentage okay this one is one thing so let me show you this one first okay i'm playing as i'm playing as client for on dedicated servers okay so if i enter only my health change or you can say client of an health change and this one regenerating thing everything is sync on that events you can you would just everything will find sort of fine okay so if i uh, it's all on you uh, like i add a widget for upper health bar uh, on player head just a widget i make that widget world and just make this one as visible and again make this one on screen so uh, there is my player icon uh, the widget always focus on me okay and on widget class i gave that health ui class here okay uh, nothing else so this will do just uh, uh, bottom one health bar this will on the owning client but i want the upper head progress bar to visible for everyone so i'm using this multicast event a simple event i will make this one multicast uh, reliable and for this one i will get my health bar i will check if this one is valid or not if this one is valid uh, means i want to use this event for this client only or 
whatever correct uh, actor is this for this one i will get get user visit object from here and i will cast to that visit okay from that visit i will get health bar and i will update percentage um, i mean i will set percentage of that progress bar okay uh, this event is replicated or multicast so everyone can see it if i will make this one only owning client only i can see if i will make this one server only server can see if i will make this one multicast everyone can see server or any client okay that's why i'm using these different okay and you can use same for this health system also i think everything is here related to health and health system uh i got a review negative review very negative from this person that crash project after opening re reference level uh, can't package this one was issue from my side or uh, like from my plugin this one was only default i changed this one to pre default so every time i do any change uh, this will this will not removed from here okay so this one is all everything is replicated fully like progress bar i show you everything you can uh, get this source code from my github you can modify it you can ask me for any change in the system or you want any like updates for plugin i'm here okay so bye bye